The training held at Soroti Catholic Youth Centre equipped participants with essential business skills, including financial management, marketing strategies and customer service. The key success factors of the business. By providing these tools, Enterprise Uganda aims to help PDM beneficiaries transform their businesses into sustainable and profitable ventures. Business development services are not like release of credit, which you can do with a button. You just press a button like this, the entire country has received money. When it comes to building entrepreneurs, changing mindsets, you do 1,000 at a time, 1,200 in five days. That's what we are doing. So whereas the other one is a FASA program, and whereas government wants to see that FASA program taking place, you can't stop it. But that does not stop you from doing what you are doing now here. So as Enterprise Uganda, with the resources we have, we are proceeding to make sure that we make the best of a government program and create the most impactful output out of it. This initiative aligns with the government's efforts to promote economic growth and development at the grassroots level. Soroti City RDC, who also took part in this training, highlighted that these initiatives will go a long way in helping to reach at informed decisions with regards PDM funds. For me, my view is before a program like this one is started, a, a beneficiary must be identified and trained into business skills, given business skills, because the money is for business, it's not for eating. So they must be trained to do business. And after training, they must be given uh, training specifically to come up with business plans, which business plans must be monitored in terms of implementation. When they implement it, they must be monitored. And the money is given according to tranches, according to the training, according to the business plans, and not given at once, but given in tranches. And that tranche is, is, is monitored that there is a success in our project. Some participants we talked to after the training promised to be agents of change in their respective communities. We have been thinking that anybody is entitled to come and borrow him in the circle. But according to the training, we have learned that a person who is supposed to borrow money from the circle must be having a business that is running so that a person is able to pay the, to pay the loan. By focusing on the parish level and providing targeted support, the parish development model aims to address poverty and improve the livelihoods of vulnerable populations.